This right here is the most popular concealer in America, and it's a drugstore find. So I'm gonna put it to the test and see if it lives up to the hype. This is Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Dark Circle Eraser. It's a super concentrated formula meant to conceal dark circles and fine lines, but many people also love it to cover blemishes and contour their faces. I've even heard that Gigi Hadid uses it to perfect her skin when she's not using foundation. It has a sponge applicator so you can easily dab or swipe the product where you want it, then use your fingers or a tool like the Beauty Blender to blend it out. To make this a little bit more interesting, I'm gonna apply it to one side of my face and then compare it to my trusty NARS concealer on this side of my face. So let's try it. All right, so I went ahead and took my foundation and concealer off under my eyes, and then I just blended my foundation up because normally when I use concealer, I would have foundation on. I'm gonna put on the NARS first because I already know what this is gonna look like and we wanna compare it. I always just make an upside down triangle and kind of go like this and blend it in. I'm using my finger just so that we have like an easy baseline. Cause not everybody uses a beauty blender, but I, I normally would use a beauty blender. I spread it out because I, I never want my concealer to just be right here. I kind of go down with it a little bit so that it makes the whole area brighten up. All right, that's the NARS. Okay, so now let's try the Maybelline. I'm going to click it just a little bit. I don't want to have too much come out. And I'm going to put a little bit more. I'm not used to it yet, so. I think this one is more of a dabbing. But again, doing a little bit of that upside down triangle. And then I'm gonna blend. Hmm, I kinda like it. So I'll tell you right away, the big difference is this feels a little bit lighter and it went on smoother. Like I had to dab it and I wondered if I was gonna like that dabbing motion. But once I dabbed it on, it really blended easily. And that was just one layer and you can see that even like my freckle or my hyperpigmentation, you can see that it's really blended away. And I really do, I think it looks good, you guys. I think it looks good. I'm gonna put a little bit of powder because I normally would. I'm gonna set it and then I'm gonna fix my blush and then let's see what it looks like after that. So I applied a little bit of powder to set it and I touched up my blush, but the things I noticed were the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer is a little bit thicker. Some people want thicker, but I never realized how thick it was until I compared it to the Maybelline. The Maybelline goes on really light. It feels really sheer when you put it on and it blends really easily. Like I felt like I barely patted it and it was blended into my skin. You know, it's not really like a good or bad thing. It's just an interesting thing to know. I tend to go a little bit lighter with my concealer, just a touch lighter so that it brightens the eye area. So my NARS concealer is a little bit lighter than this Maybelline. Um, the Maybelline actually did match my skin tone perfectly, but I think I would go a, just a touch lighter. So I might go a shade down with this one. This color is medium in the Maybelline and this is custard. I've been using that for a long time, but I will say that Nikki, my makeup artist, she always ends up using custard and a little bit of honey and mixes that color together. The big thing here is this is a $10 concealer and this is a $30 concealer. And you know what? I think they're both really, really great. So that tells you something. I'm a big loyal fan of NARS. I've been using the Radiant Creamy Concealer for a long, long time. So I'm probably still gonna keep using it. But you know what? I'm gonna keep testing this out too and see how I like it. So follow me on Instagram because I'll give you some updates. It's at Susan Yara. I'm gonna keep using this, you guys. I'm gonna keep using it. What's your favorite concealer? Is it this Maybelline one? Is it this one from NARS? Tell me in the comments below. Give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and watch our next video.